What's up everybody, Tony here with High Tech Check, and today we're going to be taking a look at a very customizable case for the iPhone 13 Pro Max made by Rhino Shield, as well as their film screen protector. Now the thing that sets apart this case from all the rest is the customization. You can change out the back camera ring color to pretty much anything that you want, as well as the volume and power buttons. That is pretty cool. Now Rhino Shield also does offer cases and screen protectors for our other phones as well, so I will be putting a link in the description to their website in case you guys want to check that out. And for all my listeners out there, I will be putting a coupon code good for 10% off your purchase. Now these cases are pretty protective against drops, especially when you're going to be using them along with the screen protector. Just take a look at this. So the first thing we're going to do is install the screen protector so when I put the phone in the case you can see how well they fit. So here we get a one screen protector, we get a guide, and we get our little installation kit. So the first thing you're going to want to do is to wipe off the screen really well with your wipe. And then once you're done with that we're going to go ahead and put our guide on. Make sure that the top goes towards the top of the screen, just like that. And you can use your dust sticker to get rid of any dust you might encounter. And then once you're done with that, you're going to want to take your screen protector here. You're going to see we have some tabs. You want to make sure that the, the holes line up with the corresponding pegs on the guide. We have three at the bottom and we have two at the top there. Then what you're going to want to do is to peel off tab one, which is the underside. Make sure you don't touch that once you've peeled it off. Then we're going to go ahead and put this uh, on the guide. Make sure you line up all the holes. Once you have the holes lined up, you're going to want to take your squeegee and just squeegee down on the, the middle there towards the top, just like that, and then do the same thing for the bottom. And then once you have it squeegee down, we're going to go ahead and pull up on tab two, just like that. And then we can go ahead and take our guide off. All right, so that came out pretty good. We do have a slight bubble at the bottom right there, which will hopefully come out uh, over the course of a couple days, but uh, feels pretty good. Feels almost like the glass that's on the phone, and the fit seems to be pretty good as well. Comes right up to the edge of the phone there. Just leaves a cutout for your earpiece. Like I said before, it feels pretty nice. Fingerprints. It does show some fingerprints, but those are easily uh, wiped away with minimal effort. Very nice. And as far as the touch sensitivity, like I said before, it's nice and smooth, very responsive. It's also very clear. No issues there. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at the case here. As you can see, it is an all clear case. It is very hard. There is no flex to this case whatsoever. The sides are hard as well as the back. So if you happen to drop your phone, you don't have to worry about anything happening to it in this case. And then like I said before, you can customize this case with the camera cutout color as well as the volume and power buttons. All you need to do is simply push down on the camera ring there and it pops right out and then you can just simply pop your other color right in from the bottom uh, through to the top and now your camera rings white and then as far as the buttons go <laughs> very easy to change out all you need to do is press in towards the case on these button and they, and they simply pop in and then here you have a ton of colors to choose from and the way that you install these is from the opposite way just push from the inside of the case out just like that, and it looks just like that. So you're gonna find some sort of color that you absolutely love to customize your case with. So I'll go ahead and push our phone in here, just simply press it into place, and then there's also that protector on the back as well. 
So that does look pretty cool. It is very easy to put your phone in the case. We'll go ahead and take a look around here. As you can see, there's still a raised lip around the edge of the phone to protect the screen. And I do also have that screen protector on here as well. And it looks like it comes uh, right up to those edges too. So that'll give you that full coverage protection. Buttons, very clicky and responsive. Very nice. Show off the color of your phone with that accented ca uh, camera ring. As far as fingerprints goes, it does show very minimal fingerprints, but again, you can just wipe those away. I like the showing off the color of my phone better. Got your cutouts on the bottom there, your power button, volume buttons, and the mute button. And because of that camera bump, it does raise, give a little raised edge for the camera as well for some protection. And it does feel good in the hand as well. It doesn't feel slippery. It has a nice little grip to it. So that is pretty cool. I do like the customization of the case itself. Now they also have another clear case that does have the Snoopy picture on the back here. It's pretty much just like the other clear case. You can customize the buttons as well as that camera ring just as responsive as the other one, but it's got the Snoopy picture on the back. And they also do have these lanyards that connect to your phone's cases in case you wanna uh, connect that to your backpack or maybe wear it around your neck as well. And this is how the lanyard works. In with the lanyard are, is this little package and you get all these little connectors just like that. So we're gonna take a couple of these connectors, any color you want. You're gonna take your case and you're going to push these through the little uh, speaker holes just like that. And then just kind of twist them so they turn just like that. So when you're done, it'll look just like that. Then we're gonna take our lanyard and you're gonna unscrew the caps on one of these lanyards here, just like that. We're gonna take it out of the little holder and then we're gonna run it through these little holes And then we'll run that one end back up through the little plastic holder, and then we'll screw on the little cap again. And there you go. Then all you need to do is put your phone in the case and you can cinch it up as much as you want. So that is pretty much it for the Rhino Shield screen protector and case for the iPhone 13 Pro Max. If you guys want to pick any of this up yourself, I will be putting a link in the description. And if you guys like me and you want to support my channel, please use those links because it helps me keep purchasing products with reviews for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that little notification bell to let you guys know when I put out new videos. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you have a great day. I'll see you in the next one. Later.